Hi, thank you so much. Election day is here, and by the end of the day, voters will decide uh, who will become and who will take over control of Congress. The two candidates are fighting to be Florida's governor. Hit the campaign trail one last time, hoping to clinch your vote, as well as the nearly 4 million unaffiliated voters in our state. Our Josa Carbonari continues our live team coverage this morning on Commitment 2022. She joins us live from West Palm Beach. Josie. Well, polls open at 7 a.m. this morning, but there are some changes this year that you will need to know before heading to the polls. First, redistricting is a major change. A lot of locations, polling locations have changed. So before heading out to vote this morning, you will want to make sure that you know exactly where you are headed. Those of you with vote by mail ballots in previous elections, envelopes needed to be postmarked by election day, but that has since changed. Your ballot will need to be returned to the elections office by the time voting ends at 7 p.m. And in the case the weather ramps up and power goes out, all supervisor of elections offices, including Palm Beach County and those in the Treasure Coast, they tell me they have battery powered equipment that can run for a few hours without electricity as a backup. Again, polls open at 7 a.m. They will remain open through 7 p.m. For more on polling locations, you can visit our website, WPBF.com. Reporting from West Palm Beach, I'm Josie Carbonari, WPBF. 25.